and we are back with we're gonna start the yacht tour with the most uh, asked question yeah how, how do, do i get the jet ski up yeah because normally there's one jet ski and then there's another and this is how we get the jet ski up we have philip demonstrating the uh, crane and winch it's and good so it's it's good if it's not so windy so it's essentially one hook on each side et voila all hooked up Right now. Not on that side. All hooked up. You're too it. big, Philip. You have to jump in the water. No, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm fine. Right. <laughs> Go. He thinks it's too cold. And Philip's gonna get off here halfway. Smooth operator. Yes, smooth. We still have a pretty uh, inexperienced crew here, but we're working uh, to get the team building feeling together. <laughs> Et voilà. Someone is taking notes. Leon, does it look like they're doing it okay? Et voilà. So yeah, that's how you get the jet skis up here. I know that whenever Richard films the boat, he gets that question. But now you know. So now we are gonna do a little walkthrough and show you what has been updated and what has been uh, improved and fixed. And you know, it's become a very, very, very nice boat. Yeah, should we start up here or up here is good? We start wherever you think. So let's start up here. Okay. So like everything of this is new and the teak is sanded. Yeah, I wish you guys could see like, I mean, <laughs> yeah, the difference on the teak is incredible. Even the table, this has all been sanded. This looked uh, very used. Yeah. And new covers, everything new here. He. Yeah. New cover there. New or cover there. Yeah. Chill bench. And then everything is new here. With carbon and uh, new sim rod. Everything is all new. modern and nice. Yeah. That was really. I don't know if you have any picture of the old one, but yeah. Mostly, Wherever yeah. we have good comparison pictures, we're yeah. gonna throw them in here yeah. or a little video things. But even this was. Yeah. Terrible. One was stuck on very high. Yeah. <laughs> and now it's. Uh, they did a really good job. Yeah. So same fabric here as on the uh, covers. And I have to say, having a boat with a flybridge is fantastic. Yeah, that's nice. And uh, here we have to... Oh, you haven't cleaned since yesterday, Jon. No, I was too tired. <laughs> you know, we got we to gotta work on our crew. The crew is slacking. Yeah. <laughs> okay, see you guys in a little bit. See ya. So what do you do with the teak? I sand it and I put a special oil. Uh, I use this one because I really like this one. Teak wonder. Yeah. How many hours in total would you say has gone into the uh, teak? Oh, probably uh, every day, eight hours for two, three weeks. So a lot of work. Yeah. Table as well. Yeah. New cushions. Yes. And then teak yeah, here on the back. Yeah. And the mighty great looking fenders. And I'm waiting. Hopefully next week I get this with lights and everything. Yeah. We decreased the size of the uh, Helena logo because it looks much more modern that way. And what have I done here? A lot. As you can see here, carpet changes, uh, fabric, and of course you're, you're of course you're gonna change it all. Et took voila! Away all the, took away all the wood. Everything you see is black. It was uh, wood like this, and in here was I don't remember. Stuff was here, a lot of things, and we yeah. took it away and put the TV going up and down. The difference here, um, and then most importantly, <laughs> yeah, it's really nice. It's so soft to walk. The white carpet. Yeah. Super practical, but it, I mean, hold on, let me back up here. So this is what it looks like now. It's baby friendly. Very baby friendly. <laughs> New uh, covers for all the sofas with uh, more of a sort of indoor home fabric rather than kind of the, and then here, all the black leather here, like. All the air condition, it changed. Throw everything out, the old one. So it's a new Dometic. Dometic. Like nice new proper uh, displays as well. Yes. And these are black now that used to be kind of half gold, half chrome. And here I put the table. Lounge. Yeah, we were saying to have, um, or Richard was saying table. to have um, yeah, like a breakfast table here. Yeah. So new table, freshly dressed, uh, dressed uh, sofa. And also black in the ceiling instead of wood. And we put a fridge here. There was actually a TV here. Wait, come here. I know there's a, a video shot of uh, where you see it from here. Yeah. So check out before. And then it's weird that they only have one chair. And now you see it like this. So all this 
It's done black instead of white. It was more like brown beige. Oh, I think it was the same color as this. It was supposed to be, but then yeah. there was some yeah. uh, damage to it. Yeah. And then new black captain's chair. Yeah. And here there's a lot of magic. Here you have, you have a bunch of cameras, so you can connect uh, yeah, a bunch yeah. of different cameras. But here we have the engine room now, and the big screen there, and all the displays there, and all carbon here in the back. That turned out to be a big, That's big a difference. Huge difference. Let me just turn around so you can see it here from mucho, mucho nicer. Then we have the kitchen in here. The Actually kitchen. Good kitchen. And, and the uh, black ceilings. Yeah. And the front cabin. And voila. Our bedroom. Our bedroom. Yeah. Yes. Voila. It's nice. It's a lot of space. Yeah. I mean, here, mostly the carpet and a bit of black parts, yeah. which I think makes yeah. a big difference. And we, me and Yanni were supposed to sleep in here. Then we realized that Leon takes up, you know, a big part of the bed in the middle. So we give this room to the boys. And here's the uh, bathroom here, black ceiling as well. And then we have Isaac's room in here. Isaac? Should we go down in your cabin? Uh, I think the crew did a very bad job there last night. I uh, think he's fired, that guy. Andrew. Andrew is fired. <laughs> but you have, you have actually a bathroom here and a good... Uh, you can sleep, I don't know, four people in here. Yeah, we didn't even bother to... We, we kind of put everything just to make it a little clean. But yeah, here, full size. Yeah. Probably 230 wide. Yeah. But yeah, Andrew, you better step up. <laughs> So Andrew is the um, useless deckhand in, uh, what's it called? Below Deck? Below Deck. Below Deck on Netflix. It's about a uh, And then you have my cabin yacht. down here. Yeah, we're, we're uh, gonna... You want me to go first? But yeah, Below Deck, you can check it out. It's uh, kind of a fun uh, TV show. But we're gonna go down into El Ricardo. Proper. Go, go stand over there, Yanis. We get a, a size reference. The LEDs are giving me a little bit of flickering, but I hope ah, that's you okay. You want me to turn off? Uh, yeah, that's more pleasant. Okay. So here's my bedroom. I'm not complaining. <laughs> I still doesn't sleep well, but <laughs> but it's nice to be awake in this room. <laughs> <laughs> that's a yeah. much, much better. Yeah. And then it's hard, like, if you didn't s see like all of this, what this looks like before, I mean, it was kind of like, like wood that was broken massive, and- Massive, massive different. And then of course, jacuzzi. Not a bad day. Good day. New covers here and everything new. And then I think, I mean, I've seen all the work that you've done and it doesn't all come across on video because a lot of it is repairing, wiring, making sure all the electrics work. Yeah, and all the cleaning under the boat. And in, yeah, it's been a massive work. I have help from Diego. He's been like a terrific guy. He helped me a lot, especially with ele electric things and toilets and stuff. So I don't do things wrong, but it's been a really challenge to yeah do this. but it's yeah. not your first boat fixer-upper no it's probably my fifth or sixth yeah well, so. you, live, you live and you learn yeah but I think it's nice when you do things by yourself it's more fun to use them 100% yeah I'm trying to learn as well I'm looking at a lot of things I don't know what they are but I'm trying to learn <laughs> but job well done and we're kind of considering these days kind of like a shakedown yeah to test and see things uh, we're still learning yeah you saw yesterday the roof was leaking so we took it down and we sealed it mm. and now it's back on and now so it's fixed perfect. now it is all good it's like your belly in okay <laughs> <laughs> i keep my shirt on i've been in in lockdown for eight weeks so. last vlog in colombia i was like oh look are you in the boat it's like that boat i'm like you know what screw it who cares we are back we are vlogging again and we're gonna keep doing vlogs uh this time not on a strict schedule because then i just get stressed and i don't enjoy it so whenever we have something fun to film we're gonna film it so stay tuned we, we are probably gonna go for a long ride with the boat yeah yes yes a lot of fun things coming up in the summer so sorry for disappearing for a bit but i needed to take some me time and you know think about me and my health Good. and my baby and my wife but now it's time to jump in the water before we head back towards puerto banus so we'll see you soon real soon we have we've got a lot of stuff going on at the house so more updates to come Ciao, ciao, and good ciao, job, ciao. Ricardo. Thank you. And thank you for letting us uh, hang out on this wonderful My boat. Pleasure. Whoop. No Yanni here. Well, I guess, can you guys say uh, ciao then? Ciao, ciao. Isaac's really excited. <laughs> ciao. <laughs> ciao. Yanni gives you guys her best wishes. We'll see you soon. Over now. <laughs>